We are going to play the number grid difference game. You can find out how to play by looking in your math reference book on page 140. What you need is you need a number grid, you need a deck of cards, each of you needs a marker. We have these circles that we use. You need a dry erase marker as well and a number grid difference game record sheet. You can see I have the record sheet over there. You might also want to use a calculator to add up the numbers at the very end. All right, we're going to go ahead and get started. Our first player is Lucas, and he's going to draw two cards from the deck. He drew the numbers six and seven. Can you place those down on the table so I can see them in the camera? He can make the number 67 or 76. What would you like to make, Lucas? All right, he's going to make 76 and put his marker on 76. Now it's Jackson's turn, and he's going to draw two cards. And let's see what number he's going to make. You can't use double digits, so he just redraws. He got a 6 and a 2. Do you want to make the number 62 or 26? 62. So he puts it on 62. Now, because Lucas started, he's going to count the difference between 62 and 76. Lucas, can you put your finger on the number grid and count for me? Start at the yellow one, and let's count together. Very good. 14. He counted 14. Notice how he counted 10 down first, and then he counted 14. Now he's going to do the recording. His record sheet is on the top. Whoops, on the top. So his number was 76, so he's going to write 76. Jackson's number was 62, so he's going to write 62. He counted the difference, and it was 14, so he'll write 14. Good. Now it's Jackson's turn. Jackson, you get to go first, and you're going to pick two cards. And you're going to make a number. It could be 18 or 81. All right, so he's going to put it on 81. <clears throat> then, Lucas, you can pick two cards. Get rid of double-digit numbers. All right, you can make 34 or 43. He's going to make 43. All right, now it's Jackson's turn to count to figure out the difference between 81 and 43. 20, 30. Now we can count by ones at 30. So 30. Oh, not backwards. 31, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38. So the difference is 38. So he's going to write that down before he forgets. Then his number was for 81, and Lucas's number was. 43. So they're going to keep playing and they're going to go back and forth, back and forth until everything is filled up. Then I want you to take a look at the record sheet. In order to figure out who will win, you have to add up the score. So the difference is 35, 14, and he'll have three more numbers. So he's going to add up all those numbers on a calculator. Then, down here, he's going to add up his numbers on a calculator. Look at, he has 10 and 30. He'll have three more, and he'll add those up on a calculator. Whoever has the highest score wins.